For all the fans on Twitter who are promoting tanking, I understand your pain. I understand what you're doing. I don't like what you're doing, but I get it. For all the fans on Twitter who are complaining about those fans, same thing. I understand your pain. I get it. I don't do it personally. I just ignore them. But I want to say to you specifically, you know who I'm talking about. For the past 15 years, the Montreal Canadiens have scored, on average, 220 goals per season. Two, two, zero, zero. Two, two, zero. 220 goals per season. Most Stanley Cup winning teams score, on average, of 260 to 300 goals for, and 200 goals against. That's, that's the minimum. But the goals for, specifically, 260 to 300 goals. The Montreal Canadiens for the past 15 years, 220. This is simple math in my eyes. I understand that you need quality defense, great goaltending, timely goals from whomever. doesn't matter. You need goals, but you need lots of them. And this fan... Montreal Canadiens, 52 years old, born and raised in Prince Edward Island, frozen in Manitoba for the last 30 years. And I'm sick of watching this team score 220 goals per season. It's the blue collar, hard work, nose to the grind, pull your socks up, tie those laces tight. That's the only way to win for the Montreal Canadiens lately. And I believe you me. It's entertaining to watch, but I, you're not going to win anything this way. Ooh, we might squeak into the playoffs. That's great. And we're going to draft in the 20s. But that's... You can't build a winner that way. I understand what you're saying. The Leafs and Oilers. Yes, yes, yes. That's two examples. But I can name Chicago, Pittsburgh, Washington, Tampa Bay, LA. All these teams have really good talent, really strong defense, really good goaltending, lots of goals. And one, the only exception would be the Boston Bruins and maybe the, the St. Louis Blues. Those are two teams who are built specifically by drafting and developing. They really didn't have any high-end talent, elite talent. Neither do we. We haven't had elite talent since Carey Price. And really, does he count? Because he's not a player. He's not a forward. He's a, he's a goaltender. And that's, the other, that's my other point. When you have a, a goaltender such as Carey Price in goal, you play the game to Carey Price. And that's what they did with the 220 goals. I understand that. And it would make more sense if, how do we say this? Now that he is gone, we have a chance to build the same way that most teams do. 260 goals to 300 goals for per season. That's the key, my friend.